Here she is. The year was 1978 and Carla L. Brown was living in Wood River, Illinois. She moved in with her fiance, boyfriend. I think they were going to get married. And unfortunately he came home and found her murdered. So we're here today to remember Carla I had meant to bring some flowers and I unfortunately was unable to get those. So I'm going to leave a penny to show that someone was here today to remember her life. Rest in peace, Carla. And I believe Jo Ellen Brown is her mother resting beside her. She died in 1994. <clears throat> Excuse me. One can only imagine the heartbreak that she suffered. Carla's father had died several years ago at the age of 40 something in a some sort of freak accident. I don't remember what the uh, details are, but. So she and her mother were very close. Carla was attending SIU Edwardsville, which is just right down the road here. We are about 30 miles east of St. Louis, Missouri. Carla's case was featured on Forensic Files, and you can look that up. It's uh, got some historic uh, elements to it in that the bite mark that was found on her they used DNA to uh, finally capture her killer and he was sentenced to prison uh, but I believe he was paroled a few years ago This yellow house with the uh, brick front is the house where Carla was living at the time of the murder. She was found in the basement of this house. 